So Margaret, you're here today. Uh, how many weeks after you had your Achilles tendon surgery? Uh, almost eight. Uh, had it done eight. Uh, May the first. Uh huh. And today we're almost into July, right? Yes. So you were sent to me by another podiatrist, yes. right? And uh, you and Dr. Lubshin have tried multiple things to try mm -hmm. to get your Achilles tendon to behave. Yes. And it didn't really work, no. right? So you guys ended up getting your records here and um, we decided to do that new procedure um, called Tangent Achilles Tendon Repair where instead of doing old traditional surgery which would really take you out of commission for a long time uh, I did the minimally invasive technique. Yeah. So, speak up. <laughs> well, it's 100% better than it was, and like you said, it was minimally, minimally invasive, uh -huh. and I've done great. So, um, you were off your foot completely for, for one week. week, for mm -hmm. one week, and then you wore a boot for one yes. additional week, right? Correct. And then, you know, we did the lasers, physical therapy, mm -hmm. You know, we still did our due diligence. Yes. But uh, if you look back and how much pain you had prior to the ten jet procedure to now, uh, how much pain you had two months ago and how much pain do you have now? Can you sort of describe it? Compared to two months ago, I would say none. You okay. know, uh, I can still feel it, mm -hmm. but it's not painful. Good. When I get up in the morning, I'm. Do your exercises, exercise to right? Loosen it up. Exactly. Well, the beauty of the tenjet also is instead of masking the problem, we're sort of fixing it, right? Mm -hmm. And we're not cutting the tendon, which obviously is associated with more wound dehiscence yes. and scar tissue. We're sort of fixing it. Uh, so, for people who suffer with Achilles tendonitis, would you recommend this type of Very a procedure? Much so. Very much. So I had a friend who had the foot operation, and she said uh -huh. she was off of it for almost 10 months. 10 months, right. Mm -hmm. Well, as I told you, I did the open procedure for the first mm -hmm. 17 years of my practice, and uh, it's not that it didn't work, it just took such a long right. time, and the wound dehiscence, like in the literature, was as high as 30%, and obviously, like mm -hmm. with diabetics, it was always an issue too, Yes. because the wounds just didn't heal very well. So, uh, I'm happy that you've done so well. I am too. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to let you go today unless there is a problem. Yeah. So, no news is good news. Right. Perfect. Thank you.